So let's say coaching, right? So oh, you're a coach as well. Yeah, I'm a coach. Business coach or life coach? I co coach confidence in all areas. Okay. In business. So I do coaching for business clients and I'll do coaching for one-on-one -on -one individuals. I do coaching for teenagers. Mm -hmm. I do coaching for schools. I do so there are people who build businesses and then they don't have confidence? Yes. I'm asking deliberately. <laughs> <laughs> yes. They, they, I, I spoke about earlier before you, you came in. I spoke about chasing money, right? Mm -hmm. There are pe people who get into business chasing money, uh -huh. but they, they actually don't have confidence to because remember confidence is the one that will get you winning and get you you know being resilient and going the people that give give up more laying quicker they never had the confidence to, to but i had or money is a confidence booster yeah but it, it's not confidence hmm. it's a confidence booster oh yeah, the money is not confidence. it's not confidence and that's why we're having a lot of problems now because people think accumulating certain things is confidence no it's a confidence booster but we can you can have the money and still have a low self-esteem hmm. you can have the car and still have a low self-esteem you can have a successful business but i can intimidate you entering here with no business because the low self esteem. Because you have a low self esteem. But now, when you've got confidence, I'm not intimidated. I don't care what you have. I don't care where you're standing and you're ranking. But I'm not intimidated by you because I am fine with who I am. I've got confidence in who I am. So people can enter spaces. People can win, but they are not confident. For as long as you lack um, confidence, you, you have a low self esteem. It denies you so many things, and some of them you're not even aware of. Because there's an unconscious, you know, people who have money, they think they're confident. And now you see with GPV and a lot of men abusing women that you actually have a low, low self-esteem, my guy. You actually have, um, uh, uh, um, um, what do you call these things? Uh, yeah, yeah. Inferiority like, complex. Inferiority complex. Oh, too, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a conversation, of course. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you have um, an inferiority complex. Yeah, I think that's one of the main issues. Yes. So when that pops in, sometimes yao kawata without even you realizing. The inferiority complex. Yes. Because you don't know that when, when will it be triggered? When does it appear? So w when you are confident, you know, or when I enter this space, yay, and only a trigger of a low, you know, inferiority complex because I'm not that good mm -hmm. in speaking. My guy said there, when he stood up, we asked a question, he was answered, was, he said, I'm not that good with English ne? before he spoke. Mm -hmm. And I can come and say, but we never said speak in English. But he felt there's a need for me to speak in English because we are speaking in English here. Right? But no one said speak in uh, English. English is an international language, man. Yeah, but... <laughs> like it's Chinese for me and my cousins and my, <laughs> and my grandmother there. It's not for, it's not for a podcast. Look, no, blah, blah, it's Chinese for me and my grandmother. That's why the English is important. Yeah, it's important. But you need to know that there are certain things are not a requirement to enter. I'm not, like, not even talking about the English, but you, 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 you can be okay and you can acknowledge that that's not my space. Okay, I've got a question. Yes. What is the best way to build? Because I feel like there's a difference between low self-esteem, self mm. lack of confidence, mm. and inferiority complex. I feel like those, those things, although they sound similar, yes. they're a bit different, different in the sense that Confidence could be you have you have this surety of what you're good at, but maybe you're good at speaking, but you've got a low self-esteem. But but you're good at speaking, but you how you view yourself yeah. is low. But when when they say here's a mic, Kisama can kill it, right? Yeah. But when I enter into a room full of business people, maybe yeah. how I view myself, yeah, I feel I don't have that. Uh, a self-esteem that allows me to operate in that room because I don't see myself worthy. But I'm a confident speaker. But I don't see myself as a worthy person. Okay. You know why? I always group them. Yeah, uh, 
right? My view of myself does not change. It's consistent. But no what, what, if, what if you see yourself as nothing? Yeah, that's where you have a problem. You have a... But you're a confident speaker. No, there's no way. There's no way that can happen. You can't see... But yourself. you know there are people who can confidently talk nonsense. <laughs> well... <laughs> then, <laughs> yeah, no, then, then, then that's fine. But they're confident. In the nonsense. A am I wrong, guys? <laughs> but they're confident in, in what they're saying. That yeah. Whatever nonsense they're talking about at that moment, it, yeah. you will look at them and say, ah, nonsense. The guy doesn't care. He's confident in what he's saying. So in my opinion, right? Uh, Confidence is a response. Okay, to? Who you are. Okay, tell us more. So, I know that, okay, I'm, 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 I'm born again again. I draw my confidence from the weight. Word of, the word of God. The word of God. I get, the Bible says, I am a city on a hill. I get, mm. It does not say, so you, you look at what, what a city is, right? It will shine. It will shine. And the Bible says, I must arise and shine, right? So when the Bible says, I shine, it does not mean, it did not say have a car so that you shine. It said you are a city on a hill. I respect the authority of the word of the Lord over my life. And this is where I draw my confidence to say my confidence is not from what I have, what I've achieved and what I can do. And it, 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 it stems first. The foundation of my confidence is what the word says about me. So whether uh, according to society, it looks like it or not. It's none of my business. My business and my view does not change because I view myself at the level of what the word says. So whether I've got the money that society says it should prove that, I mean, I mean, if you say you are successful, you should be able to live in a certain area. You should be able to do certain things. It's, not, it, it, it's a non-matter for me. I view myself in a certain way. Then I carry out, you know, certain things, everything that I do, I carry it out at that level of how I view myself. So if you view yourself as a low level person or whatever, there's no way you can carry out big things. So if you enter in a room right, with business people and then they're doing well and whatnot, Mara, when you, you view yourself, it means when they ask you a question, you might not even contribute because you're thinking, I mean, they're already billionaires. What am I, they, what, what can I contribute to these people? Hey, the problem is, yeah, I know a lot of people with low self-esteem with money, man. Hey. but they have it. Yes. And they, they, they are confident. No, no, what? <laughs> <laughs> They're not. They think they are. <laughs> they think they are. They have. Because remember society. This is the thing that we must always, you know, break down the wall of what society says certain things look like and what they are. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Um, because society always has success. I mean, a successful uh, man, you must be this, you must work, you must marry, you must have children. But that success template might not look like that for me. And I must be able to say, this is not a successful template for me. Whoever is a template. But there's a template. There nonetheless. are certain things. Eh? But there's a template nonetheless. For certain Get out things, even yes. for yourself, you have a template. Yes. For instance, you yes. mentioned the word of God. Yes. Drawing confidence from it. Yes. That's your personal. Yes. So meaning what, when, what I'm hearing from you is that it's important for anyone who's listening to have their own personal template yes. of what success looks like to yes. them. Yes. So that they can be, because I feel like it means different things to different people. Yes. It, it does. It can't mean the same to all of us. No, it can't. 